Hello, uh, today I had something interesting happen in class, one of my VIP kid classes that I submitted a ticket for. <laughs> um, I had a student, well I'll read the ticket to you, I like how they put my full name, Jason Raychik, whatever. During class, it was somewhere between 18 minutes and 19 minutes, the student stood up from his seat and showed his underwear to the teacher. The student did this purposely. Um, he did do it on purpose, but not out of, he wasn't, he wasn't doing his, um, out of malicious intent. Um, he, he'll just do things spontaneously like that, thinking it's funny. Um, he really wants to make the class funny. <laughs> he, he has no ill intent, but he stood up, um, he has no pants on, had his underwear. He bent over and showed me his rear. <laughs> and, um, <laughs> we pointed the rear to him. I didn't see the whole bottom. He, he still had his underwear on. And, there was, I saw some anatomy there. It's like, oh, oh, and immediately I dressed it, and we, like in five seconds, I had him back down in his seat. We went on, I told him never do that again. We went on to class. I didn't make a big deal out of it. But, um, and again, I've been a teacher for 18 and a half, going on 19 years at the end of this calendar year. In December, we'll make 19 years. And so I've been, I've seen, I've <laughs> just about anything you can as a teacher. Um, uh, flipped off, body parts, shunt, yeah, anything. I've, yeah, puked on, kids sit on my lap, and, and everything else. So those things don't really phase me. It's just, <laughs> these are being recorded, and um, so, so I'm wondering, I've never had to submit a ticket for this before. Um, now, I've had kids stand up, and I've seen their underwear, but it's been by accident. They just sit back down, and we all move on with life. Usually the parents there to with them, because it's usually a small child. This one's, he is, he is 11 or 12, I think, I want to say he's 11 or 12, I can't remember. Uh, I didn't know he had, I didn't, I didn't realize he came to class with no pants. I know he does homeschooling. I think he's homeschooled because um, anytime we talk about school, he talks about never going. And he'll book, and his parents will book him at times that most kids in China are in school. And he does live in China, so, and so I, it leads me to believe that he's either homeschooled or, um, I know I don't know what city he lives in, if they're in quarantine or not. Anyway, that's not the point. I just uh, <laughs> here we are getting ready to end our tenure with VIP Kid, and I'm finally getting <laughs> uh, to submit a ticket to have maybe. And I'm sure they'll delete the video because of um, uh, legality reasons. They're not going to keep a video of a child uh, bending over, showing his rear and his underwear like that. <laughs> that's what. That's that's why I did that. So. But, just thought I'd share this. Um, again, it's best just not make a big deal out of it. You know, I've seen some teachers get on the Facebook group and act like they're traumatized and, oh my God, I could not, you know, I did this whole thing. Oh, uh, I feel like that sometimes when reading some of the teacher's Facebook posts. Uh, he stood up and I saw his underwear. Oh, I'm so, uh, you know, you can tell these, they've either never been a parent or, <laughs> or um, they've never been a teacher. Um, teacher of children and so you know again I've been sneezed on snot puked on uh, farted on <laughs> and anything under the sun I've <laughs> I've had kids try to yank my pants down I've had them yank their pants down I, anyway. so stuff like that really doesn't face me anymore being cussed out flipped off so you know just we go on with life and that's how we addressed it in class I just five to ten seconds we addressed it he sat back down we went on with class um, I left a note in the chat so his mom would see it, and so I told him I have to report this. And we, he goes, <gasps> and then we said, "Let's move on, though." And so, <laughs> anyway, I just thought I'd share that. <laughs> anyway, um, that's all I have. Bye bye.